Hey, how you doing? This is Martone, owner turn of Fuller Fitness. I hope you are doing well, especially uh, this season. Um, and at this point of the year where a lot of or certain people are going back to school, whether that be uh, high school or college or anything else, but specifically for uh, the college students, because with the college students, uh, Something uh, that I, I find interesting and that bothered me when I was in college back in 2004, my freshman year in college, um, I think my sophomore year or two in college, was hearing about the freshman 15, um, which at the time didn't make sense. And um, I didn't know what it was. So then when I heard what it was, especially for me to be, uh, I was an active person. I am a active person and hopefully I am always blessed to be uh, an active person and uh, freshman 15 did not make sense to me and to a certain degree it still doesn't uh, depending on what you're doing and what you have available to overcome was called the uh, freshman 15 uh, which for the most part unless proven otherwise just means that um, it's it's likely for uh, college students, especially the first year, to gain at least 15 pounds, uh, likely of fat. Um, and again, I had a problem with it then, and I pretty much still have a problem with it now. So the focus of this video is to do, um, and I think I'm going to do some others as well, is to uh, provide some information to hopefully help you overcome uh, what's known as uh, the freshman 15. So as far as overcoming a freshman 15, uh, the goal of this video and probably many of the others is to um, provide information about equipment that you can use um, to help you overcome the freshman 15. Um, I think one of the things that um, motivate the idea, the thought, and the conversation of um, freshman 15 um, and for me just the college 15 is what I would say because it might not just be the freshman year um, is to use certain equipment without again depending on how many videos uh, people have seen or I've said it before and I mean it and that's what uh, this and I believe a few other videos uh, will be about um, not needing a lot of, of equipment and not needing a lot of space. So with that being said, if you get yourself some bands and depending on where you get your bands from, I believe you'll have at least a minimum of three bands. I think uh, instead of selling them one at a time like they did when I was in college back in the early 2000s, Instead of you getting, excuse me, one band at a time, now you can get up to three, anywhere between three and five, three, three to six, uh, depending on where you get them from and what your need is to where you have it to where you'll be able to use bands based off of your ability and your goal. So the minimum band, depending on which one you get, will likely be yellow. And this one is equivalent to three pounds, but the more you stretch any band, the more you will fill it. All right, then as far as the, the bands that I have, the next one would be green, which is basically five pounds. Again, the more you stretch it, the more you'll fill it. The third one is equivalent to eight pounds, according to, at least when you're starting. Um, again, the more you stretch it, the more you'll fill it. Now, Let's say you have the three pound band and it's too light and depending on what you're doing is very likely it will be late. So then you have the opportunity to, let me grab this handle. So let, again, let's say you have the three pound band and it's too light, which is likely it will be depending on what you're doing. So you'll hook that on to your handle or bar if you have that. And again, if that's too light, then you can just click that on. So now you have what's supposedly equivalent to eight pounds. 
depending on what you're doing. But again, the more you stretch it, the more you feel it. So it might feel like 20 or 30 pounds, depending on how tall you are and how strong you are at this point in your life. Um, and being able to do certain things, whether it be a shoulder press, a bicep curl, a tricep extension, unless you have it uh, a door anchor, which you would if you uh, get this from certain companies, almost all of them at this point, uh, and do a tricep press down, working your abs, working your back, working your thighs, working your hamstrings. So again, you don't need a lot of space. You don't need a lot of equipment. And there's a strong possibility, depending on where you get your band from, where you'll get a door anchor, a minimum of three bands, three between three and five bands, uh, a door anchor to, to do uh, things, depending on what you're trying to do as far as tricep extensions and things like that. Um, two handles um, and a bag. It, uh, these will be in a bag if I'm not mistaken. It's been a while since I bought mine, but I believe you'll have a, a bag with four or five bands, depending on which uh, bands you choose to get and where you're getting them from, who you're getting them from. You'll get a bag. It'll have three to five bands in it, depending on what you pay for. Two handles. Um, a door anchor and that might be it but again that depends on uh, what you pay for so again to help you with whatever your goal is whether you're trying to increase your strength decrease fat increase a certain amount of muscle uh, gain a little muscle mass um, and do all of that without spending a lot of money without buying a lot of equipment without needing a lot of space so um, that's up to you so again just look into some bands um, I don't get paid for it not that it should matter all that much I don't get paid for it but the bands that I've been using for almost 20 years I think at least 18 years at this point is body elastics um, I haven't had issues with them as long as you don't do anything crazy or stupid with them um, you don't need a, a, a lot of them um, you don't have to spend a lot of money and if you have a roommate or family or friend depending on what your situation is all of you will be able to use them depending on what you're doing and what you specifically need so again give that a uh, look into that in terms of um, getting bands having a certain amount of bands using them in ways that work best for you and not spending a lot of money um, not needing a lot of space. Um, not only that, if you're interested in in-person workouts and you're in Amherst, um, Amherst, New York, um, you can get help from me as well, whether that be in person or online. Um, and then if you're a college student somewhere and you're seeing this video, interested in personal training, obviously if you're not in Amherst, um, investing in online workouts so that way I can help you there um, so again this is all about you being able to do more in less time which I've been talking about for almost two decades um, also not spending a lot of money so again look into bands specifically I've been using body elastics hope you enjoy this video take care